We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone. Opportunities may only come once in a lifetime, and luckily, time is on our side to witness the rare impact. The Great Soulful. I am Jessica Scullin, who is G, we see the world beyond the deal. And I am Ace Mendoza, ang alas ng masa. And on behalf of the organizers, welcome to this year's The Great Conjunction. We would like to thank our sponsor, SMBF Baranaque, for making this event possible and to reach more people. Yes, thank you so much, SM, for sharing your interest in our event and for also helping us reach out to more people as we aim to reach for the stars. Now throughout the program, Camilo and I will be asking random questions related to tonight's event. You may participate and answer the questions through the comments section for a shout out as well as saying a message on air if you get the answer correctly. You may send your messages in the said comment section or message the Bed and Society of Young Astronomers page. This is just the perfect way for you to use your geekiness and astronomy to confess to your crush. There will be seven questions all throughout the program, so you have seven chances to profess your deepest desires. With that, Ace, what is the Great Conjunction exactly? So before we explain what Great really is, it is a, a conjunction is the alignment of two astrological or space bodies as observed from the Earth. Tonight, we will be witnessing the Great Conjunction as we'll see the alignment of the two greatest worlds in the solar system, the mighty planet Jupiter and the glorious ring Saturn. GC, they say this is indeed a lucky event because of the solstice, but what exactly is a solstice? A solstice is basically an astronomical event where the Earth experiences either the longest or shortest days. So with that, there are two types of solstices, the winter and the summer solstice. So first, the winter solstice, which we will be experiencing today, December 21st. As you can look outside, it is starting to, the sun is starting to set and my camera is becoming dark. So this signifies the longest night of the year. This happens because of the axis of the Earth, which tilts at an angle of 23.5 degrees. Because of this, the winter solstice happens when we are facing away from the sun. So, for its perspective, this is the Earth and this is the axis. 
So for the winter solstice to happen, we must be here and the sun is here. So another, on, the, on the other hand, the summer solstice or the longest day of the year, which is from June, which this year was June 21st, happens when we are facing directly at the sun. So from this diagram again, we, we are supposed to be here and the sun is up here. Again, with that, we can check up on our live viewing of the great solstice conjunction. So how are we doing, Ace? I am Camilla. So in a few moments, in a while, we will be witnessing this great conjunction. So we'll be seeing both Jupiter and Saturn in one field of from the telescopic view. Now to others, the planets may even seem like one big and bright star. So ayon, the great conjunction happens every 20 years. So the last one happened in 2000. The closest it has been at only 0.1 degrees happened about 400 years ago in the Middle, Middle Ages in 1623. Now, fun fact about this one, it was around the time of the first publication of the collected works of Shakespeare. So, to view this once in a lifetime event, you may do so facing the southwest sky. So, back to you, Camilo. So, that is indeed interesting. So, if you want to view, I'll reiterate, you must look at the southwest sky or the southwest portion. So, with that, did you also know that Johannes Kepler, the famed astronomer uh, in charge or responsible for the planetary motion, uh, the laws of planetary motion, he also observed the Great Conjunction when 1604. Yes, 1604. He observed that there was a conjunction by not just the two planets, Jupiter and Sat uh, Jupiter and Saturn, but also the red, the red giant himself, Mars. So yun, the three of them formed a fiery dragon as they are both, as the three of them were the vertices of one giant astronomical planet. He also predicted these the year before as he observed the conjunction of Jupiter and Saturn. He also predicted several more of them in the same year. Yeah, so now it isn't too boring because you have more than one astronomical event than the great conjunction that we will be witnessing in a while. We have an almost first quarter moon and the Ursid meteor shower seen around the Little the little Dipper and the Big Dipper. This will be seen from December 17 to 26, always around the winter solstice. Camilla? Yeah, and also with that, with the, let's go back to the end. Let's go back to the great solstice conjunction. So, what you will observe later on is that the two planets will form a bright one shining star, which is also called the Christmas Christmas star. So, as you may have heard, or as you may have learned through our uh, through our readings in the Bible, yes, um, the Christmas star was the guiding star of the three shepherds or the three kings in leading them to Jesus Christ. So, astronomers believed that. The, this star was formed through the great conjunction that happened in those times, which Johannes Kepler actually, as I mentioned, before, Johannes Kepler, actually, uh, he actually predicted, which was seven BC. I'm not sure on the accuracy, but it is very, very close to what is actually happening. So, Ace, what is the meaning, or how can I relate myself to the great conjunction? So, Ayan, before I answer your question earlier, GC, we would like to tell our, all our viewers today that we still do not have the live video, but we we have the moon as seen from the telescopic view of our moderator, Sir Jun Kahigal. So, here we can see the moon. So, Ayan. So, Ayan, before we later on, we'll be seeing the Great Conjunction in a few moments. Now, given the current events, we can say that this pandemic happened because of a few conjunctions before. Now, today, it is indeed a lucky day because if we're going to see the Great Conjunction, it's going to be big, something big. Now, since it's also bright, we can also associate it to hope, what we call hope. So this conjunction, Saturn and Jupiter, can serve as a beacon of hope for people for better days to come in 2020. So, ayon, 
GC, may gusto ka bang idagdag on how this is relevant in the in an astronomical sense? So, if you are a lover, a follower, or a believer in astrology, this may be the year for you. Because according to astrology, um, Jupiter and Saturn may represent uh, two versions of uh, leadership. Or, parang yung beacon, let's say, beacon of hope, or yung guiding light. Parang yung Christmas star. O, oh, diba? So, sa Jupiter, represents you parang lashes there, which is free will or very free leadership in terms of ano, in terms of um, eating so he's very generous he is very blessed with health well and enjoyment in all aspects while Saturn is more of a let's say authoritarian which is very strict and has limits so with that you can have a power struggle but in other words, it's mostly like, oh no, uh, good things will happen to you this year. Good things will happen, but don't forget that you have to work for it and to earn it under Saturn and Jupiter's eyes. Now, a very interesting thing is, um, take it. Before I move on to that, maybe first move on to our first question, the comment section. So, Ace, do you want to introduce our first question? Ayan, to our viewers, I hope you have been talking for the past minutes as we are waiting for the live feed of Jupiter and Saturn. So for the first question, when was the last greatest or the closest great conjunction? You may answer, you may send your answers, type your answers in the comments section and our chat moderators will be seeing it to it in a few. Again, when was the closest great conjunction aside from today's conjunction you may send your, or you may type in your answers in the comment section <coughs> gc yeah. may we proceed yeah so while you're answering i will answer my question so from here there's a very big significance now that you want the big conjunction in terms of leadership but more so on the ano, parang social because um like mentioned earlier the conjunction may be an omen good or bad that may lead to change and hopefully this year it will bring out good change or start or spark of a renaissance period now looking here the great conjunction is said to uh said to happen among the aquarius constellations now this I heard you were an Aquarius, so this might be for you. Is that true? You? Hindi ka sure, but actually about this one. Um, I think I've mentioned it to me before that Aquarius is also associated with the LGBTQA plus QIA plus. Am I right? Yes, yes, you are. Right. So how is this related to the said community? So because I just love Aquarius people. Of course, I do. I mean, <laughs> so we have a response here. I will wait for my moderators to chat. But the question that we asked earlier was when was the year of the last conference? So I can answer. Finally. What was the answer again? 400 We've years. asked for the specific year, not the number of years ago. Sige, hulaan mo. Hulaan mo na lang. 1226. Hmm. Uh, I think that's a little farther than but, the correct answer. Do we have other entries? I think someone might actually get the correct answer this time. Do the math. It's 2020, people. The first answer already gave you clues. You know? It's the 2020. Year 2020, Hello, we please. have an answer for 400 years ago. Yeah. Good check. Yes, so. Um, so, Ayan. 400 years ago. Let's see. 20. Yun? Minus 4. Yeah, GC, yeah. ikaw ang STEM student sa ating dalawa. Madali lang siguro mag-subtract. 
Twenty twenty six hundred. Exceed more than one. Okay, one. Starting one. Mm. One thousand. Okay. I think that's a safe answer. <laughs> we'll be waiting. Our shop moderators will moderators will be checking in on your answers in a few. What happened in four hundred? Ayan. Oh, sayang kasi yung mga oppor- As Jizzy said in his opening statement, opportunities. Close. Close. Gwen, what's her name? Gwen T. Castillo. That's close. That is close. That is really, really close. Still, we're still, I don't know, we're still searching for the correct last digit. Last digit, guys. That is Probabilities close. around nine. <laughs> Ooh, that's far. Nice try, BB. I mean, you're close, actually. That may be considered as an answer, but it wasn't the one we were looking for. Because, hmm. because it may happen around 400. Parang every four. Now, now, Camilo, let's not be confused. 400 years is like an estimation. It's either round up or round down. So, we're not sure. But I've mentioned it before. As, 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 as I've remembered, ang sinabi ko kasi kanina, para around 400 years ago, it's around the same time first publication of this of collection of Shakespearean works. So I've mentioned that four-digit year. You know, already one already answered. Mm. Tama ba yun, Camila? Okay, wait. He, okay. Tama ba siya? Um, who answered it? Wait. So, Einstein? Einstein, Einstein Malata answered, answered 1623. We got it. That is we correct. <laughs> Let's go. So, so can... did he leave a message for a shout out? We'll be waiting. Give him a shout out, Einstein Malata. You got the correct answer. So, just leave your message down in the comment section. Yeah. So, as a lover of Aquarius science, uh, uh, a lover of Aquarius science, this great conjunction represents social change because the Aquarius, the sign of Aquarius, is actually a sign of social change and humanitarian efforts. So, that this may be symbolic to what may be happening in the in the in the next year. So we may be seeing more humanitarian acts, or we may be seeing more health and good fortune because of Jupiter but as mentioned you have to work hard for you know, work hard for your effort uh, for your goals and maybe it may be given to you with good uh, with good luck and good fortune and with that Ace is there something that you have been working hard for and I've been working want- hard for I uh, I've been working hard to keep safe this quarantine because I mean the pandemic isn't going anywhere but we can take safe measures on our, our on our own. But um something I work hard on is yeah to live on until the next years of my life and to actually get to register once I'm in I'm of legal age already <laughs> to vote for the next elections and such. Now I would, I think all of us is striving for stability and yeah, proper health. I would. <laughs> exactly. So, as a PSA, as a public service announcement, we would like to remind all of you to stay safe this Christmas and um, wash your hands, keep your mask. I don't have a mask, I'm at home. Okay. But always wash your hands. And yes, and as mentioned by Ace, go out and vote. 2021 is also the year, actually, 2022 is actually the year we get to vote. So, me, you, maybe everybody who's above 18, who knows? Please vote. It is your voice. So, with that, uh, going back, the Aquarius sign is also associated with the LGBTQIA+. Plus, it was mentioned by Ace earlier. It is this is this means that these people are open, are open-hearted and open-minded. So, ang saya naman nung parang ang laki ng buo sa Dubai. Ayan. 
So here, guys, we're still seeing the moon because given the weather, it's actually quite cloudy and it's already dark. And our dear moderator, Sir Jun Kahigal, really loves us all because he's still finding effort to show us the Great Conjunction. We will be seeing it in a few. But however, I think GC, Camillo, are you there? Because I think it is time to give the next question. But before the next question, can we see his message? Did he leave a message? Einstein Malate. Oh, Einstein. Einstein, father of relativity. I believe so. So, did he leave a message? They said he didn't. So, okay, we'll be waiting. We actually still owe Wait, Einstein a lot. I don't know if he's still here, but we owe him a shout out and a message if he wishes to use that favor. Now, we still have three, or we still have six questions, six opportunities for you to shout out special persons or your loved ones. Now, GC, what could be our second question? Hmm. Let's go with an easy question. Yes, it is today's main event. So, next question. What are the planets involved in this so called great conjunction? So, again, which planets are involved in the great conjunction? You may type in your answers in the comments section. And our chat moderators will be catering to you in a few. Remember, guys, opportunities come once in a lifetime, but you can make your own opportunities. And so far, we are offering six of you for up for grabs to confess to your crushes or say little messages that can actually alleviate the Christmas spirit around us. Mm. And so we do hope you are appreciating the live stream of this moon because it is really, really pretty, especially for a night owl like me. How about you, GC? Are you a, an early bird or a night owl? Hmm. Actually... Actually, I am a bird. I'm an early bird, but it just comes up. <laughs> uh, sometimes I just wake up late for class. Five minutes, ten, an hour, maybe. So, um, but the thing is about being an early bird is just that it's the one of the best things because when you wake up, let's say you're back in face to face. Usually, I walk. I walk a little bit before the LRT. LRT station. So being like an early bird, you get to see you know, uh, the sun rising and the morning star Venus. So with, there are also advantages naman sa, sa beginning, parang a night owl. Because you get to see more. You get to stay up later. Uh, see the stars. Like yung, ano, yung previous, um, yung previous meteor shower, the Geonids, uh, Geomini. A media shower that was from the Gemini or the constellation of Gemini. So shout out to my Gemini again. Uh, this the peak usually happens around 2 a.m. and I cannot reach that time. So there are advantages on both sides. But overall, only person for the win. Ikaw is. Yeah. More. So before I answer your question, we have oh wow. We have we have a lot of people who try to answer this one because it's really easy question I think anyone could answer. It just shows how attentive they are of this event. So we have two answers. Sige. Parang mabait ako. Gusto ko maging Christmas Santa right now because I mean, Christmas spirit tayo ngayon. I have my Christmas tree set up right here. You are wearing your Christmas hat, GC. Yeah, that's cool. We've coordinated on this one. We'll be entertaining all the correct answers na sinansamin ng chat moderators natin. So first off, we have Remo, I don't know how to pronounce your first name. Is it Ton or Ton? Is it Ton Tone? Remo? I'll just call you Remo if, it, if that's okay. That's okay. You've got the correct answer. It is Jupiter and Sa Jupiter and Saturn who are involved in the Great Conjunction. Now, along with this is Lareza. Is it Lareza? Is it pronounced as Shania or Shania? Eh? Yeah, Sh Shania or Shania. Shania, Shania. I don't know, kind of correct me if I'm wrong. But again, so far, we have, uh, no, 
We have two correct answers. We owe you a shout out and a message. So you can type in your shout outs or you can message the BSYA page, you know. I don't think if it's down here or on the side, on either side, it might be up here. We don't know. <laughs> but yeah, we just, really uh, love you guys. So we just aim to entertain you right now as we enjoy the lovely view of the moon, you know. So as we are waiting for the moon, do we have a simul uh, simulation of? Do we have a simulation? Oh, ayo may nag correct sa atin. Thank you so much, Tonet Remo. Yeah, so you may have your shout out. Hmm. So with that, um, do you do you guys wanna answer one more question before we move on to the next topic? Medyo competitive ang ating viewers. I think they deserve more questions to answer. Exactly. We're gonna have this question be more like, mas ma have a Medyo ba mahirap? Medyo mahirap? Or medyo madali? Ano ba? Let's go! So, to our... Ayan, to our chat moderators, do inform us if they have or they already sent their messages or their... Ano, how do you say this? Their shoutouts. Now, I think one chat moderator will be sending their name. You can message them also. So, yeah. here. Anong pwedeng tanong natin? Camilo. I am very curious on astrology. I am a Scorpio. We have, you know, you know, there's a secretive side, but there's also the speed and kind thing. So, um, for this next question, what is your zodiac? So, not only will you type it down, but you will also say your traits that are associated with you and what makes you unique. So, yun. so what is your zodiac sign? What are the traits? And what makes you unique from all the signs? Pwede ko bang sagutin yan? Kasi I will still give my answer even though hindi ako magkatagot dyan. So, I am an Aquarius, guys. And I'm just someone who's extroverted, the introverted. How do I say this? I am an extrovert to the people, but I'm an introvert as well. Tama ba yung sinasabi ko? Ayan. So, again, um, type your answers in the comment section po. Or you can message. Yeah, for the answers of to the questions, you may comment. Type it in the comment section. As para pag message, you can message the BSYA. Or just type in your messages in the comment section as well. Now, from earlier, again, to Tonette Remo. Hi, all the way from Batangas. Wow, on layo because... I am here in Pangasinan, and he's from but he's in Batangas. Hi, I'll visit Batangas soon. I really hope we can see you there. And regards to you, and I wish you a merry Christmas. Yeah. And to the one earlier, Miss Lareza, Shania Lareza, ayan. Hi as well. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Ayan. Thank you so much. So to our, you. yeah, to our chat moderators, do we have an answer already? So while we're waiting for no, while we're waiting for our chat moderators to send us their answer, um, we would like to remind you if you enjoy the stream, so please uh, heart your apps, like, just like, it's all up to you. Uh, share it on all social media platforms using the hashtags we have, which is hashtag #BFA, hashtag the Great Conjunction, and hashtag SM to the Mark. Are our sponsors? So thank you so much, SM for thank sponsors. you so much, SM. So, ayan. Ayan. oh my gosh, Camilo, yeah. Camilo, are you there? Because Mr. Ramo is a really, really attentive and a really, really competitive um, viewer because he, he participated in the next question. Ayan. Yeah. So he said that Sagittarius are free-spirited people. So ayan. Hi again. Do you have a message and such? We will shout out for you. Exactly. So here, Miss Shania mm -hmm. Lareza from Leyte. Hi. Regards to you guys out there. Happy holidays and I hope you enjoy this Christmas break. And hello din daw. <laughs> hello din daw sa Manila. Yes. Hello. Yeah, to all those in Manila. 
Happy holidays. Um. So, with that, uh, happy holidays in Manila. I can't wait to go back for face to face classes. Hopefully next year, please. Ayan. Uh, yeah. That's the thing. You may also comment your schools for a more integrated, you know, viewer organizer here. I mean, I don't know about you, but Heights and Valley University, Manila. Hello. I want to go back. Uh, now, woman, I was my. Ayan. Kami lang may nagpabate ulit. May nagpa shout out. So, we have Hannah de la Cruz from Manila. Also, Rasel Fudolik. Did I say it right? Correct me if I am wrong. And yeah, Mishanaya again said happy holidays to us. Thank you. We really love interactive audience. You know, it's just a nice way to communicate and build rapport with your viewers and such. And ito pa si Tonera. Tonera mo. Shout out to Quezon City. Hi. Yes. Hi. Hi, my kids. I am in Quezon City. So if you're in the area, uh, raise up. <laughs> or, I know. Or just, you know, say hello. So, Ayan. Ooh, we have another answer. We have another answer from our audience. Ayun. Yeah, so again, our chat moderators and our co-organizers are reminding us that we are in a few minutes to witness the Great Conjunction this 2020 ever since the 1623rd year. Oh, base yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, so may delay time, but we are ready. Conjunction. Um, we will be seeing it in a few minutes, but that's it. Yeah, so the answers. GC, would you like to read the answers? So we have our very own Angeline Kila. Hello, welcome to the She said that he is a Virgo and they are patient. Wow, please. I beg to differ. It's a PM, Spera. <laughs> Pressy, let's, <be> <laughs> let's be kind. Okay, I'm not gonna expose, but thank you so much for, for, for your participation. Please comment down below your message, and we will read them when we receive them. So, next. I think there's another answer. Yes, last answer. So we have Eileen Malubai. Did I say it right? Pisces, simple living person. Wow, I love a simple life. You know. Hi guys, like you can we can shout you out and send your messages in the comment section or message BSYA. Plus, also we would like to greet SM. SMBF is watching us right now. Thank you so much again for sponsoring this event, and thank you for sharing your interest with us in the Great Conjunction. Yes, thank you so much. So if you don't know already. SM. They are the largest, uh, the largest mall franchises or largest malls in the Asia. I think it's Southeast Asia. I think it's Southeast Asia. They are pretty famous if you don't know. Maybe we can share your story that was told to us. So, what do you know about SM and their humble beginnings? Ooh, that's nice. What do we know about SM? I think it's like the Pumbans and Greeting Clip meeting place of everyone who wishes to meet up with their peers, you know? Tapos lang kayo. You'd, you'd go to, you'd, since you're on a budget, you'd go to the ano, food court. Kasi mas, mas yung mga foods dun, right? Tapos marami yeah. ka pang options. So, titingin ka dito, oh, I want the salt. Titingin ka dito, oh, I want the drink. Parang ganun, di ba? Which is actually nice. It's actually nice. I mean, mm -hmm. I've heard a lot of stories about SM. Very good stories, okay? I'm not just saying that because they're sponsoring us. It's just that they're, they're very, very good people. It's service that they give. Like you, your humble beginnings, as an idea. Actually, shoe mark. Like, they were a sellers of shoes. That's why, ma, like, I've been told a lot of this time. For my time. But it's a shoe mark, and I'm like, what? And ah! And that history was brought about, like, a couple years ago, when they were starting out. The, I'm not sure the name, but when I remember, I will mention his name because just in case, Henry C. That is his name, Henry C. 
Ayun, Ayan, Camilo. Ayan, Camilo. Our moderator has been giving us updates, so we he, we hope, also Sir Jun, hope that you are enjoying the live stream, the live scope of the moon because so far as we can see, it is glowing, half, <laughs> half, it's half, but it is glowing. It is a really really pretty sight. So if kayo hindi kayo content this one, you may, you may view the moon outside your homes because i mean kita naman siya but not as clear as this one so you know why we'll be seeing seeing um jupiter and saturn now to our viewers to our dear viewers you may comment your section from where you you'll be greeted you want to be greeted from greeted to i don't know but kung gusto mabati kayo shout out kayo do comment so we, we can give you a shout out or any message oh ayan na we have a message from Rom Bicol. Hope everyone is doing well. Merry Christmas. So, Merry Christmas. Thank you. Uh, stay safe. Rom Bicol. Thank you. Ayan. Oh my gosh. Have you seen those two dots? Oh, oh my god. It is a really good view. So, Camilo, si ano daw gamit na telescope na ating moderator? Sino daw to? Hmm, I am not sure actually. Is this the famous Whitey? Or is it Little Hulk or Bizarre? Yeah, so before Sir June answers your question, there is a shout out to Hannah de la Cruz from Palompon Institute of Technology. Hi! Ah, uh, yeah, we did mention that we were gonna shout out in schools. Yeah. So, <laughs> Ayun, Tambele University, please. Are you watching? Because Merry Christmas. So, nang hindi ito. So, ayun. Um, ano pa? So, so sino uh, daw ang ating telescope? Hmm. He is set. Ooh! He is actually setting up the aforementioned Whitey. So, if you don't know, White is actually. I'm not sure if I remember correctly, but he is a reflector, re reflector telescope. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, he has a small lens. But, so, I can't wait. I don't have a picture. Oh no, I don't have a picture. I am. I am in law. Before we proceed to telling about YT, so our dear moderator tells us to tell told us to tell you that as you can see from the telescopic view, we can see both planets in one field. So it is incredibly close, and it will be a lot more closer later on. You know, guys. So keep on watching, and sana makita natin tong mga ito later on, mas close pa. And if you don't know the relevance or how amazing this is to us astronomers, this happens once in a lifetime or let's say around 20, 20 to 40 years. If I'm if I'm not mistaken, 20, 20 years. Thank you. 20 years. But, <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> well, but, but uh, as mentioned earlier, in an answer from our comment section, these two planets will be close super close to form one giant star or one bright star called the christmas star and the last time this has happened was either 1000 years ago in the birth of christ or or or, or uh, 1623 so ah uh, it's a sight to see and I... oh my gosh can you see it i think it's a lot more closer than earlier Oh, it's oh, cute kasi dalawa siyang, ano, dalawa siyang line, dalawa siyang dots. And actually, fun fact, I just oh. noticed that because I have two piercings here in my lobe, and then it looks like my piercing, kasi pa ganun sila, one here and then one here. So, I, that's just, oh. I'm so happy. But <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm good. Okay, next time, next great conjunction, kung buhay pa man tayo, I want to see those two piercings light up. Kaya may ilaw ito. Ito, may stories na ito. Baka madagdagan yan. Why not? So, 
This is nice. So yeah, we'll see them a lot more clear later on. I think it's a bit cloudy. Or imagine I got just bang ating moderator. Yeah, it's cloudy. So it's yeah, so they're just adjusting because whether it's not actually weather. But it's still a sight to see, even though we only see those two specs and not really a clear picture. Because, you know, there are hundreds of thousands, maybe millions of miles away from this planet. Yeah. That's also an addition, yung kanina, the, the next great conjunction at Anasinabet, based on articles and studies as well, was is to be in 60 years, 2080. But we are not sure, but we are hoping that we do witness it because para ma defeat naman natin yung sinasabi nila na this is a once in a lifetime moment, diba? So you were already lucky if you witnessed it this year and then you also witness it in 60 years, right? Tama. What a long life you have. <laughs> We hope that 2021 is the start, it is the peak of the great, let's say, we're calling it now, the great renaissance generation. Oh, right? Yeah, we are manifesting. We are manifesting. Works. We are manifesting it. It might be a long time, pa? We still wait long, but I mean, we are hoping. You take all possibilities into account and just hope for the best or which interests you both best, right? Yeah. So I think there are more shout outs, GC, because after shout outs, we'd be asking another question for our dear viewers. Hmm. Yeah. But first, do we have the message? Okay. Do we have the message of Sir Einstein Malate? Einstein Malate, do we have a message? We're gonna we're gonna wait for that. Um, we're gonna wait yeah. for that for the moderators and also from uh Aki. Na bangit na pala natin yun. Okay, Tony. Can I? Yeah. Okay. Okay. And so guys, don't be shy. Just comment your location or your schools, or you oh. want us to greet your crush. Parang gano, you want us to greet your parents. And also, I'd like to greet my mom. I don't. I think she's here. I think. I I'm uh, <laughs> been chatting me saying, "Ang tagal na mag start because I mean we sa- we have a schedule to follow." So again, hi Ma. I don't know if you can. I know you can see me. Yeah, hi. So Jeezy, is there someone you want to shout out or greet on air? Hmm. Meron ba? Hmm. I'm just gonna be cheesy and say that I wanna thank the team ng BSOA, my officers. Ah. Uh, for helping us organize this, Kuz, sharing technical behind, he is our technical head, he is behind the screen. He also made a frame. I also want to thank you, know, my members who helped. I'm not going to mention the name because there are 150 of you. So. But, you know, Hi. thank you everyone for your support. Uh, thank you everyone for your, you know, your trust. And we will make sure that 2021 will be manifest. You will be manifesting the best year of your life, even though we are on the online platform. Okay. Ayan. So, may yeah. nagpapa shout out again. I think it's Franz. Franz. Wait, lang, may lumabas na accent. So, Franz. Franz, hello daw from Las Pinas. And, ayan. P I C A R. I don't know if it's pronounced as Picar or whatever. But, yeah, but to be safe, we'll say P I C A R. Homeschooler from Las Pinas daw. Hi, po. Hello. Thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you all so much. So we have a message from Tony Remo. Would you want to read it or should I? <clears throat> I guess I would. Ayan, Camilo. May bago na naman tayo. Message from Sir Remo. Wow. So he said that in astrology, great conjunction means new era and changes in social reforms. Ayun daw. So, such a fun fact. Thank you for sharing that with us, Paul. We really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you all so much. It means, well, ang gula naman yun. It means social reform, para new beginning. A new, a new beginning. How about you, Ace? What, may, what is, parang inaagani ko. 
what may be your new beginning for 2020? New beginning for 2021? Well, aside from registering for the national elections in 2020, I think new beginning. Ano ba? Hindi <laughs> na po ako masyadong manonood ng dramas in series. Hindi. I just want to graduate and actually be accepted to universities I'd apply to. Yeah. Studio yeah. style. If you see, okay, I'm talking to all of the universities out there. If you see Teresa, I think it's like a name more. Teresa Mendoza. <laughs> if you see Teresa Mendoza in your registration forms, accepted na yan sa akin. That's just, wala sa <laughs> Oh my gosh. So, ayan Camilo, someone, someone, my mom, I've mentioned her earlier. She says that she commends our hosting tonight. And she's really okay. looking forward to the conjunction. So, ayan, for now, we are still hoping na mag-clear ng konti yung clouds so we can see both Saturn and Jupiter later on. But for now, ito na naman tayo sa glowing moon na to. Ayan, so to those who... Nina mas na ko compare tayo of which is better, but to those who love the moon or like the night night people, comment on this in the section comment section. So we give you a shout out because I mean it's really rare to know people who love to prefer the night and the moon. Exactly. Because for say it's really for comforting. That, we have a message from Einstein Malate, our first answer on today's stream. So he said. Sinanga, shout out from Camarines Sur, San Jose National High School. So, shout out to Matsay and I hope you're doing well. Hi. Hi. The base is a comment, yeah, but Siginanga, but so para kay crush, but I am kay crush. Siginanga, private is cute. Hi, in regards to you all, happy holiday. Yeah, happy holidays. Para na pili, pili. <laughs> but what we are encouraging here is just enjoy, enjoy the night. If you want, you can just lie down outside and just enjoy the night. It's one of the best pastimes. Yeah. So, do we have more shout outs to our chat, chat moderators? You might, you may message us. Yeah. But. Yeah, and so. We can have one more question. Let's, let's, let's have. This is question number four. So, what is the winter solstice? Then, I reiterate, what is the winter solstice? So, what is this? What do you observe? What is the solstice? What is the solstice? What is the solstice? What is the solstice? Na yan? Can anyone answer this question in the comment section so you can earn a shout out? Well, a limited number of shout outs not in here, but I mean. For you to actually earn it, it's really yeah. how do you say this? It's really rewarding. It's like a sense of fulfillment. So, if you know the answer to what a solstice is, especially a winter solstice, please comment. Yeah. In that and, sections. Yeah. And if you are SGC? confident enough, if you are confident enough in your answer, you can also tag your message together with your answer, and we'll read it out. Yeah. Yeah, thus we also would also like to commend someone who commented on guessing which telescope our dear moderator is using right now. Sir Lawrence. Hi Lawrence. Thank you for trying and answered Skywalker. Is it Skywalker? Oh, wait, I'll check it. Hello, Lawrence. Hello, Lawrence. Hello, Lawrence. Hello, Lawrence. For more on a background answer, Sir has, I'm not sure how many, but he has four telescopes. Yes, four. Tanol. He has uh, Whitey, he has Lil, Lil Hulk, he has Visor, and he has Skywalker. His favorite is, I'm not sure. Sir, don't be mad at me. I think your favorite is Skywalker, even though you love Star Trek. I mean, he's just a really good reflective telescope that you bought in Japan. I wish. Yeah. So, my so yun, na- Camilo, from your ano, before we get to see the answers, because we're still waiting for the message message of our chat mods. So, our dear IVP is asking though from Sir if the view is visible to the naked eye. Kanon. 
I mean, definitely. You said, yeah. I mean, there you like go. You said earlier, the two planets Saturn and Jupiter will form one bright star. Um, yeah, one bright star in the sky. So you will be uh, as much as possible in as clear as sky as, as possible. You'll be able to see this. So let's hope, let's all hope that the weather is with us. So, uh, Kuz, uh, do we have a computer simulation for this? Yes, he says. I we am. Have. So, we are searching. We are now going to transition into a simulation, so you can see, or you, you can see what should happen right now. So. Uh, we have an answer. Okay. Yeah, we have an answer. So from Hannah de la Cruz, for her, the solstice, the winter solstice, is when we have longer night. The we have the longest hours for night than days. Yun yung pinaka ano. Yeah, and thank you. If you have a shout out or a message, you may comment it or send it as a message, and we'll be reading it out for you on air. And we have a special mention. From Sir Aldrin B. Dubuya, he said, "Simply, the December solstice is shortest day and longest night for the year in the Northern Hemisphere." Yes. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna uh, I'm a little bit sad. Does Anaka I think it's for a more integrated audience um, host connection as you wait to for the solarium. Can can those who because kanina pa naki kanina pa naka show ang ating moon and it's really nice because I mean ayan so the solarium can be seen at the bottom left of the screen check it out because it's really a nice simulation program yeah. now for a gnome to those who have a good view and actually a good camera or just great photographers at all you may capture. How you can see the moon, moon from your area, and then comment it in the comment section because you really love moon photos, you know. Yeah, we also would like to appreciate if you were to post them on any social platform using our hashtag, hashtag SNC yeah. calls, hashtag the Great Conjunction, and hashtag the Authority. So please share them, share our page, like our page. Who knows? You might be. Yeah. Fascinated from our content, the base. Because we will be compiling those ano, kontratahin na natin ang officers na pressy. <laughs> so we will be collecting. Those will be tagging us and using our hashtags. We will be collecting your photos and we will be post. We'll be posting it on our page. So ayon, para mak para naman mak appreciate natin ang ating photography skills niya and you're for taking the effort of appreciating the moon. Now as you can see dun sa live stream natin ng moon sa scope. Medyo parang may nagpa-fog siyang ganun, right? So don't be mistaken. I'm sorry for the noise. Uh, don't be mistaken. The, that's uh, the clouds yun. So medyo foggy siyang ganun. That's why we are switching to the simulation program of the Great Conjunction. Yeah. We do hope that it clears out later on. Yeah, we do hope for it clears, guys, as we continue with our program. So, with that, we have a question. We have a, we have a question in the comment section, which reads from... I'm not sure how to pronounce your name, but I'm I'm guessing. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong. It's Mone Takeru. Um, it. She said. He said. I'm not sure. I'm sorry. They said to they be said, to be. You know. Yeah. Hello. What time can we see the Great Conjunction? So I will ask Soju, the peak of the Great Conjunction, because it differs from regions. Because I saw in some articles it's 5:30 p.m. in UK. And uh, it's not always the same because we are the earth. The earth is round, so there are different perspectives. So, okay. Yeah. So, ito parang sinasabi daw sa atin ating other officers who keep updating us because I mean they just love us so much to give us updates once in a while. So, magic kita naman siya, but it's a bit cloudy. That's why we are focusing wow. on the moon kasi mas kita. Ayan. Here is Sir June. I think it's Sir June or is it Kuz? Sir Jun. Hi, sir. Oh. Um, we'll just wait for him. 
We're just waiting for him. If he ever wants to say something. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for asking a question, Monet Takaru. Uh, correct me if I pronounce your name, your name wrong. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. So, can we ask another question, Ace? Or do we want? What to... question? So, I thought, okay. For the next question, who was the who was the author mentioned earlier? Kung saan sinabay ang release ng com- Nang compiled works niya in 1623, about 400 years ago. Again, who was the author mentioned earlier? You may type your answers in the comment section. So, siguro hindi natin siya kilala, but for us high schoolers and actually those in college, I think they know this person because I mean, gamit na gamit siya lalo sa English, di ba, Camilo? I remember this in grade 10 English class. The Anglo-Saxon period. Take a shout out to your miss. Um, I really just, I don't know. His stories are very, actually his strategies and comedies are very, very, I don't know, parang very, very enlightening. And sometimes they cannot understand because it's only English, but it's very, very interesting if you understand it and it's very good read. For, can we say examples for his book? Any. Oops, baka madalas tayo. So let's leave it there and wait for answers. But for, to answer the question earlier on when can we see the Great Conjunction? Because we, since the peak of the conjunction varies from region to region, to, from countries and states, so we, have to, I know, we can't really give an answer. But earlier we have already shown you two dots so far. However, it's still cloudy, so I think it's still streaming because is it, is it still streaming the simulation program i'm pretty sure that yeah so it's still streaming so we can see it so simulation but later on just do hope we do hope that it's cloudy so we can see a closer picture of the two gas giants okay so just stand by wait for a moment so guys, for any shout outs, please do not be shy and type it in the comment section. Now for those who have an answer to the question earlier, you may do so. Yeah. Chat mods, keep on standby. So again, we'd like to repeat the question. Who was that famous author mentioned? When the great first great the closest great conjunction was first recorded? Yeah. So for oh no, let's go back to astrology. Everybody's favorite, everybody's favorite topic. Everybody has their like beliefs now. Um, so I'm like this because according to my sign, I am like this. But they know it in themselves. And I also I am firm believer in my tarot card reading. You know, out of interest because I'm a friend who does that too. But Ace, have we ever had like? something you wish would happen in 2021 month. Something I wish would happen? Nothing more than for this virus to stop, for this pandemic to end. So yeah, ano pa tayo. I think it's a rigorous process pa because we're still at peak and we don't know because there are like conspiracy theories. There are theories on it getting worse, on having a surge or something. But we still don't know. So far, the least we could do is to just takes precautionary measures and just be safe yeah. you know of course we should always be safe um i wish um i just wish that we can go back but um i just want to graduate like they said i want to graduate everything that happens in college it is just it is just you know satisfaction after 12 years of education you know to walk the aisle receive the awards you have worked so hard for yeah. So we have a, a question from the comment section. Do you want to read it, Ace? Uh, so, yeah. so, on the West, I saw a, from Niji Cassie De Vera. I don't know if I have pronounced it right, but do correct me if I'm wrong. So, ang tanong niya, in what? On the West side of the sky, I saw a planet. What planet is it? In the West direction, Dao. So, considering that I've mentioned earlier that you can see the Great Conjunction in the Southwest Sky, we do know that it's either Saturn or Jupiter. So, I, th- I don't think you can really distinguish it right now because you don't... It's quite difficult to see Saturn with its 
rings with its ring from using naked eye ganun. so you can i think it's either saturn or jupiter or it might be both depending on your perspective yeah so i, you know, I hope i answered your question i think it wouldn't matter which planet it is because at the peak of the great conjunction they were fall into one 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 magnificent red star, red star in the sky so it's good that you spotted that that is where it will happen so watch out for that so yeah so here i have this christmas balls because from this tree so to other people earlier it's like this or like that and then later on it'll be like this like this it's not completely like this but you can actually just see one it's just this ghost that it looks like Yung parang kambal na butas, I think it's like a strawberry. You can say it as a strawberry. Di ba yung kambal na strawberry? Parang ganyan. Yeah. You can see the ridges. Ganun. But it's not exactly one. So I think that's the one you'll be seeing. Don't need to know. If you're asking which planet, it's either Saturn or Jupiter. Or it might be both. Ayun. Yeah. I'll put these so, back. Yeah, who got who got. But it is the Christmas season. I mean, it's the holiday. Um, but are we going back to that? Our moderator has told us that Jupiter is brighter than Saturn because Saturn is away. So with that, it yeah. is brighter. That is Jupiter, and the yeah, brighter is Jupiter, and the other one is Saturn. Yeah. But going and back. so, guys, if you can see, actually, you know, it's one creepy to look at clouds going over it. It's quite dark, so you know the spooky horror feeling. But it, then it's going to be white. And then another fog clouds of a gagano. And yes, it's creepy. So it, well, we'll be waiting for your moon pictures so we can actually compile them. I think you can post them before Christmas, around tomorrow or on Wednesday. On, on this one. Uh, Christmas. As much as possible, yeah. But speaking of Christmas, we have this event, the Great Conjunction. It's actually the Great Conjunction was just out of chance that we had it, but we have an event right now as a club, which is called the Twelve Days, and this is our ninth day. So we are almost at Christmas, and we have several videos that we have posted a couple days, a couple days ago, like eight, eight days ago. So if you like what you see and you want to be fascinated more on uh, astronomy, like religion related to astronomy, mythologies, uh, pop culture, movies, songs. We have several videos that we have posted, so please check it out. On a Facebook page, it will be, I'm not sure, but maybe it's here. Ayan, Cabello. So, we have an update on our channel. So far, unfortunately, wala pa nakakakuha ng tamang sagot. So I'll give you a clue of, on one of this person's work. So earlier, ang question natin, ang, ang question pa rin naman natin hanggang ngayon is who was the author mentioned earlier na kanya yung works na, na release nung first, nung closest great conjunction. So one work of his is Macbeth. That's a clue. I don't know if you already know the answer. Macbeth is one of his works. It's one of his famous works. Uh, we also studied this in grade 10. I remember the story where I know. <laughs> She's so, 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 okay. Kasi baka ano, kasi baka mag-feel ni, ni Camilo. So, I'll, I'll say this. So, yung, so we have yung pina, not pinaka, but here in the Philippines, sa mga tinuturo sa atin. Now, the dogs are barking. I am so sorry about this one. Siguro excited lang din sila sa Great Conjunction. I don't know if you can hear them, but yeah. So, this work of this specific author has various types of literature. Merong, ano, merong poems, merong plays, dramas, and such. Parang ganun. So, mga flash fiction, ganyan. Dula. Itong reason sabi ko. Tula, tula. Parang ganun. Marami na variations yung work niya. So, chat mods, do update us. Kung may nakakuha na ng tamang sagot, ayan! Yeah, <laughs> Tama ba ang sagot nila? Ayan! So, we so, have a winner. Ba? 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 Ang ganda ng pangalan, Precious Marie 
Guna yun. Guna yun. Hi! Hi, you got the correct answer so, which was William Shakespeare. William Shakespeare. That is correct. So you can type um, a name or someone. You you have, we owe you a shout out and a message if you say so. Now guys, do message us if you have shout outs or message because we'd really appreciate it to greet you on air. Yeah, you really love like, a very interactive audience. So please do so down there. Yes. Down there? On the down side? There. We don't know. <laughs> down there? On the side? Or maybe up here? Ayan. Oh. So, um, uh, let's see. let's see what's going on. Uh -huh, we have a black screen right now. So our moderator is currently adjusting his telescope to give us the best view or his best view of the Great Injunction. So, Ayan. thank you for waiting attentively as we wait for this, uh, this astronomical event. So, Camilo, are we, do we still have more questions to ask because we're not sure we're going to be seven because our audience are really participative and attentive to what we have been saying. So, do you think they deserved a harder or an easier question? Hmm. I mean, they really did work hard. I mean, it took them a while to get to it. So, we'll get it harder. <laughs> so, okay. We mentioned that there was a famous astronomer who was in charge or who had the responsibility of giving us, actually, who was responsible for giving us the three planetary motions, law, three laws of planetary motion. So, with that, our next question is, who is this famous astrologer who observed the Great Conjunction back in 1604, as you mentioned earlier? Ayan, GC, can you repeat the question and where can they put their answers? They can put their answers down in chat box, down there, or to the side, or to the side. I don't know. We but don't they, know. <laughs> we don't know. But they are down there. Comment below and our moderators will uh, get the answers. And from looking at it, yeah. Ayan, comment down below daw, pinagalitan na kami ni, ano, ni Kuz. Kasi hindi namin alam kung saan kami tutura. Comment okay. down, because, well, wait, Camilo, tama bang down below? Kasi it's redundant. So, I think let's settle with comment down, or comment below. Oh, Ayan, yeah. <laughs> parang hindi tayo repetitive here. So, isisingit ko lang, may nagpaparandom shout out. We have Lance, Jester, Barlin. Is that right? Pa shout out po. That was my emoji pa siya yung parang may sweat dito. Tapos ka gano nakangiti na ewan. I think that's cute. Hi. Hello, Lance. And you Happy holidays and regards. Yeah. Stay safe. Ayun, so Yeah, at dahil Aquarius ako, ako mag-shout out sa kanya. Hi Jehan Clark. Pa shout out po. Dalawa exclamation point kasi hindi siya na contenta sa isa. Golden Age of Aquarius. Hi, co Aquarian. I hope you are doing well. Ayan. So, year natin next year. Yeah, year natin after this great conjunction. Tayo ang best na may impact dito. But we're not what? limiting it to Aquarius. Co Aquarian. The, uh, no. Let's go back. Uh, the Aquarius, or am I saying it correctly? It's an, it's a. Water sign? Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no it's an no. air sign. It's, no, it's an air, air sign. sign. That's, that's the disrespect, Camilo. It's an air sign. I, I, I am. <laughs> so, it looks, it I looks like a water sign, but it's not. It, it's an air sign. Yep. Air signs, like, uh, you, let's see. Aquarius are not the only signs that will benefit from this. There is also their fellow air signs, Gemini and Libra. So, I'll just read here from an article on Allure by author Amelia Quint back in December 18, recently, just a couple days ago. She said that you, as an air sign, you finally get to have some fun for one. Thanks to the Great Conjunction, you realize that prioritizing your pleasure can have serious benefits. A new look, a project, or a trip can lead to huge insights. If you've been playing it safe, this energy helps you dream bigger than you have in ages. I'm, it might be it might be scary to let yourself want something more, but if you do, my, if you wait, but if you do, you might be surprised just how much of it you can get. 
and how quickly you can get it. Instead of wringing your hands, treat the process like an advent, like an adventure, and you could find some treasure just around the corner. Well, wow, that is really interesting. <laughs> now, I thought maybe the link that Papa shot, but it's Yolito El Borlaza. Hi, shout out to my crush. Wow, first time wow. actually someone wanted to shout out their crush. Gusto mo bang mention natin ang name dyan? Just comment it below in the chat box. Medyo matapang-tapang tayo. Ayan. So may nagsasabi. Sabi na ating na ating very very talented na quiz that planets Jupiter and Saturn are now visible as one one star. Tama ba? As one. Visible as one in the sky. And, and they're so very bright right now. So we're yeah. still adjusting the telescope for us to get a very majestic, the very majestic view of these planets. So let's just yeah. wait for a while. I think you can still see the silhouette of the moon, but later on you'll be seeing bright stars. Ganun, ganyan sila. Yes. But... Ayan. So Camilo, I think may nakatama ata sa sagot natin. Hmm, tama nga ba? Nga ba, ba? Alfred Cristobal. He said Kepler. Alfred Cristobal. Hmm. Tama kaya? Maybe Kepler. Maybe it's Kepler. Right or wrong? Maybe Correct. it's... Hindi siya sure? Are you sure about that, Alfred? Alfred Cristobal, are you sure? Comment down if you are sure of your answer. I think he is already sure kasi depending sa unang sagot niya. And then he said just maybe it's Kepler because I think he's not sure after sending it. But we will be will only consider your first answer. Right, Camilo? Pero sure kaya yun? Sige, ano? Sagutin natin. Ano kaya? Wrong. In a few minutes. Sige, wait. In a few minutes, okay. We'll give you, we'll, we'll let you, ano, we'll let the pressure on. Ganyan lang. Stay lang siyang ganyan. Stay lang ka. We'll answer your, ano. <laughs> Kasi research to ni, ano, eh, ni Camilo. So, if he's wrong, yeah, then your research is also wrong. Diba? Ganun. Pero, don't know. Kasi malay mo attentive siya ever since. Diba? I mean, who knows? But, let's see. Uh, going back here, as I'm reading another article, it's on the... What's this? It's on the... It's a Stylecaster by author Shireen Campbell. So, it says here that Jupiter... In astrology, Jupiter is all about expansion. And in Aquarius, will encourage us to expand our thoughts and ideas. How do you like that? Parang enlightenment or parang uh, what's the Philippine word? Mulat. Parang nagiging mulat tayo sa more ideas. So, it is very, ano, very interesting as we, ano, as we go beyond. Yeah. Yes, it says here, since this is an air sign, because the previous conjunctions were under an earth sign so the next 150 years will be your years my aquarius my air signs and masasabi ko sana all i am scorpio i am water sign <laughs> medyo matagal pa but i mean you can make every year your year diba yeah yeah go outside no go don't, don't don't go outside not yet don't don't go outside without your uh, no, without your mask without your face shield and yes. alcohol is not in if you will if you will doing if you will. But I mean, we're always reminding you to be safe because it's Christmas. We, we hope you enjoy the holidays. But I mean, keep safe, guys. Precaution. Well, lang masama sa pagtake ng precautionary measures. Yeah. Diba? Ayan. So, ano na ba? Ano kayang state ni Alfred Cristobal ngayon? Ano sabi niya? <laughs> Napipressure kaya siya kasi... We don't know if my answer is but we have already taken in his first comment, which was Kepler. Yun lang. Hindi natin ko consider yung maybe it's Kepler. Pero tama kaya yun, Camilo? Would you like to reveal the correct answer? Sige, I need a... Gusto ko sana ng drum roll. Pero... Drum roll? <laughs> I don't have a drum! So, <laughs> the answer is... Johannes Kepler, you got it correct. I'll take it so well. Congrats. You were attended. Congratulations. Now, we, we do owe you a shout out and a message if you wish. Kasi kanina may nagpa shout out na sa crush nila baka ikaw. Mali mo, you want to send a message to your special someone or to your family? Ayun. 
Now, guys, don't be shy. Shout out lang. Pa shout out lang naman pa shout out. Yes. So. Ayan. We can see as our moderators adjusting. It's still cloudy outside. That's why we are not really seeing the view of the group and the okay? But enjoy this half moon tonight. Because the moon is shining so bright. It's very simple. You see this every day, but you sometimes just forget that it's there. So enjoy. Yeah, ayan Camilo. I think our viewers are really trying to answer. So I do have another question for them. Do you want me to ask them? So guys, who sponsored this great conjunction? Again, yes. who are who sponsored who are, this great conjunction? Who are our special partners in this event? Yes. Who kaya pa unang magsagot because our chat mo stand by on who can get the, who who first we get the correct answer. Na bulan lang ko para hindi guman ko for a second. So ayan, ay ayan nagpa shout out si Alfred Cristobal. Shout, Shout out, out daw kay Jody Baluy. Hi, Jody. Hi, Jody. I don't remember. Just like ha 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 Ayan. I can remember si Jody. Eh. Ah. Ayan. Hi. B S Y A. Ikaw out there. Di ako. I think member din sa out there. Wow. So ayan si no ang ating sponsors for tonight. Yeah. Specific ha. Specific. Kasi may dash yun, di ba? Tapos may, may place pa. Di ba? Right, Camilo? Yeah, Specific yeah. lang. Kasi baka iba yung ma-shoutout natin. Iba pala yung sponsor. Kawa pala mga yung sponsors natin. Hindi natin na. Thanks. Well, thank you again to our dear sponsors. Partner. For tonight. Ayan, may sumagot niya. Buti na lang sinabi ko talaga na kailangan specific. Kasi, ayan. Okay lang yan. Nice try. Nice try. Nice try. Thank you for the effort. So, wala pa naman. So, Ayan. speaking of our sponsors, <coughs> what is your favorite moment from visiting one of the people? Like, yeah, what is your favorite moment? Like, either with friends or with family? What is something that you remember and has a very good, long-lasting effect on you? Ano ba? Ay, ayaw ko niya. Yeah, ako yung mom ko nag nanonood, so I don't know, because she's at home. And a favorite moment with the fam, because the we usually we're like on our phones and our laptops, especially our laptops, because we have we are in the new normal mode of learning. So we're like we're like having our gadgets 24/7 instead of like eight hours or seven hours at school. So you know, I think the no favorite moment would be like taking time yung pupunta sa room namin yung mom ko tapos wala mag ano lang mag hug lang ng ganun <laughs> you know just to check up on us and such just quite random kwentuhan especially over dinner mm-hmm. ayun ka ba <laughs> uh, favorite moment it's usually actually it's always spontaneous because sometimes uh, we just go out of fun like we just want to eat to celebrate so always like, we always expect it now there's always something to celebrate about whenever we go there yeah, always go there. So, yeah, may na may na dulas pero di pa rin tama. Kaya ni Jai, Jai de Guzman, maliparin sa gut mo. SM Group of Companies that is not specific, but I like the effort. Ayan, so it has it has already been given. It's SM, but we are asking for the specific name of our sponsors for tonight. So who can get the correct answer? Better Society of Young Astronomers, Ata. We are we are a co-partner, but we are we do not, we do not sponsor this event. But we are your hosts. The Better Society of Young Astronomers are your hosts and the live stream of the Moon and the simulation of the Great Conjunction BSYA. But we are looking <clears throat> for the right sponsors up. of the Great Conjunction. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, but Okay, hang on. Um, but you can also view this. You can also view this live stream with our partners because they are actually doing a watch party with us. So, hello, mga taga. I'll see you. Mga taga dun. Hello. I hope you're enjoying. Uh, we apologize that uh, we apologize that you are not exactly seeing the conversation. But if it's cloudy, 
So we thank you all very much. As we wait for that. So, ayan. Si Kuz. Is that done? Si Kuz, I think it is still showing Solarium, the simulation program, because it is super cloudy. I think you can still see a part of the moon from the telescope of our dear moderator. But yeah. since it's super cloudy, unfortunately, you will not you will not be able to see them. Na, na magkaganon. But we do hope na from your point of view, makikita niyo sila ng ganon. However, I think Kuz can show a closer version through the simulation program. Uh, Kuz, can you? Yes. Yes, I will. Just so on the screen right now, you will see our yeah. uh, the simulation on Stellarium of what is actually happening right now if we had to hear Skype. So, we would like yes. to <laughs> we would like to commend Jai to Guzman for his efforts. Yeah, SM Pasig, I think it's a little bit close, but I mean, if you wish, you can mention every SM branch here in the Philippines in the hopes of getting the correct answer, but we really, really, really thank you for the effort of answering. Yes, we owe you, if ever you get the correct answer, we owe you a very, very long shout out. So, thank Again. you. So good. Jai, you, we owe you a shout out to the comment. To reward naman your efforts of trying to answer. However, our space leader, our moderator, has been telling us that SM is still watching. So again, we thank our dear sponsor. I will not be saying the specific name. Thank you, SM, for sponsoring tonight's event. Now on the bottom left of the screen, screen is the simulation of the Great Conjunction. So ayan. I think we'll be posting. Siguro kung may Skype. On what's happening tonight. So, uh, Camilla, yeah. yeah, we can see the beautiful moon set up by Sergeant and the simulation of the Great Conjunction. So, speaking of SM, I heard you have a tagline and I heard you can sing. Uh, can you sing us a tag, a famous, famous tagline of SM? I don't know if my voice is suited for this song because I really don't want to, like, give in justice to this song. Or, like, I'm going to With, like, a long lines of. Again? Here at SM, we got it all for you. I think that I don't want to sing it. I'm so sorry, Camilo, because I really don't want to give a bad image of this song. But it's really a nice jingle that got me. So, I'm going to go here. Here at SM, oh my god, I'm going to go to Here at SM, we got it all for you. Then suddenly, when you go to the supermarket, you can see that, oh my god. Ma, can I get the pack of cookies, ma? <laughs> can you bug me this toy? Right? Oh, I really... I really... Ah. Sino kaya? Sino sa audience dyan? If you can send us a video, then you're going to go. You are our participant for the night, I swear. You will be our creator. Yeah. Ayan, so may nakatama na ba ng sagot? Kasi so far, the, our chat moderator is... Ayan! Ayan! Oh my gosh! Tama na ba to? May kulang kasi yung sa dash, but I think we can accept this because kawawa namin yung... <laughs> but take effort talaga siya to answer this question. Diba? Yeah, so... He got it correct. Jai de Guzman. SM Paranaque. SM Paranaque. So... Again, we'd like to thank our sponsor for tonight, SMDF Paranaque. Thank you so much, Paul, for this wonderful partnership for the Great Conjunction. Thank you so much. Um, we can, and then we can have like, okay, magod din si Einstein malalat na S Super Mall, but it's not clear. But it is a brand, so we commend you for that. Uh, we have how many questions do you have yet? I think we can have. We can have. Uh, two questions. Last two questions. We have one, one last question. So here, what are our names? My partner and I. What are our names? Yes. What are? What is our? Her, 
What are our names? Are we have our... we have we have two hosts. The least you could do is name both of us because we have been talking for the last minute for the last I think an hour ago already, more than an hour ago. Oh. So I think it's just right that you can you know us already because we've been talking and talking and talking. So medyo mahirap but I mean yeah. I mean who are you? <laughs> who are you, partner? What is your name? Because I don't know you. I didn't get a name, but yeah. What are our names, guys? Yeah, what you know, are just the nickname we have been saying? Mm. Yeah. Chat mods, can you check the comment section? And also those are shout outs because we'll be using this after this question, we might actually end the stream already. Yeah. Might be your last chance. So. Mm, shout out or like mom and kid crush or whatever. So we had it. Baka may pa shout out chat biglang sabihin. Ang kwapo ko nung ano isang ho. Syempre, syempre siya hindi ako kasi I mean I mean, bakit po naka Christmas hat yung isang ho? Sus ba't po yung hair niya naka ganto dito? It's like he got a perm or something. <laughs> are those natural? Ayan. They are not. Okay. Excuse me. They are natural. And we have a sa- <laughs> we have an answer. We have an answer, but this is actually hilarious because since dalawa kami at ni relate yata talaga sa program natin tonight, ang pangalan daw natin partner ay Jupiter and Saturn. I mean, <laughs> so cute. I, that is really cute. I commend you I for like this one, Jai. I like that. Boy, take it So, what are our names, guys? What are our names? <laughs> Yeah, who is she? I think that's an easy one. I think that's an easy one. Yeah. Malay nyo makita niya ako. Malay nyo makita niya ako somewhere in Manila. Kasi, I mean, kung mag-zap man ako sa call, you will see you somewhere in Manila. I will guess it. <laughs> you have an answer from Jan Stangonang. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm Sheila. Hi, I'm Sheila. Tapos yung, yung partner ko is Limuel. <laughs> Hi, Limuel. Lemuel. Okay, Lemuel. I shall as Lemuel. I shall, I shall be named Sheila. For the rest I of the I am going to the national office and I will change my name to Sheila. Yes. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Well, Ayan. Well, last chance. Last chance. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're gonna give you a clue. We'll give so, you a clue. For her name, ano ba? you may see her as the first card in a deck of cards. Ayan, sabi ni Jai de Guzman, shout Ina. <laughs> I don't know if it is her. Ina. Because it's A. So, I mean, I think it's just, it'll just do it justice. Kung ang daming A's na sasabihin ko. Ayan, hi Ina. Hello, if so you're here, watching yeah. yeah, for a clue of my name, it's a three-letter word. It's a nickname, lang, no worry. The first letter would be A. Malapit na yun. It's just a, a syllable. So, and I then mean, for this guy, I think right screen bag and top. But, but for this guy, this partner, my partner, ang name niya. Sige, gamit natin yung dalawa. Yung dalawang letter lang. First letter is G, so you have 26 other options to think about on yeah. what the last letter is. I'll give you a number, you just have to decipher it. It is 73. You have to decipher what that means. Yeah, and that will be a clue for my name. So, we're gonna wait for that before we. So, as, while we are waiting for our chat mods to send the answers or those who answered, so we, again, we would like to thank you for joining us tonight on witnessing. Actually, unfortunately, but yeah, we did witness the Great Conjunction earlier, but we didn't see it like side to side, like really as one or something like that, or the closest they can be. But I think from your perspective, I think you can see them actually because they're bright and little, 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 naman kasi si Jupiter. So yon, medyo malapit just the moon, and you can see it so southwest. So just use your compass, your phone compass. And Hanapin yung Southwest because dun yung sila makikita talaga. Yeah. And yan. So again, we'd like to give thanks to our sponsors for tonight. Thank you, thank you so much again, SMBF Paranaque. 
for sponsoring tonight's event. I know masyado na maraming thank you, thank yous. But yeah, hindi kami magsasawang magpasalamat sa mga sumusuporta. Yeah. Sa sumusuporta talaga na astrology. So, thank you so much for joining us today. So do we have any final answers for our new name? As I, give, as I am given a clue, her name is from, if you know a deck of cards, from Baraha. She is the first card. First card there. So, and in my name, I gave you a number. It's up to you to decipher it. It is okay. So you can just uh, substitute the numbers to the corresponding letters. So, wala nyo. Ayan, so cause I don't... Can you see it? Focus daw tayo sa star. I think they're, ano, they are asking to have a view of the star as conclusion for this event. So, may nakasagot. Do you want to read it? Partner? Hmm. Tama ba yung sanagot niya? Kasi member natin to, pero tama kaya? Tama kaya? Tama kaya? Tama. <laughs> uh, we have yeah, so the... called Angeline Kila. Where? Nahulaan mo ba? Where? Okay. Nahulaan kaya niya? I don't think she really knows us that much. Pag hindi niya nahulaan ang name natin. Kaya nga. Dedudak ko yung points ko sa ano. So, cute, cute. So, sige. We are running on overtime. So, to end this week, her answer is correct. We are, or I am, I am Divi. This is Kaskola. And my partner is... I am Ace Mendoza. <laughs> Good. So, again, we'd like to thank everyone for joining us tonight. Yeah. Ayan. So, your pictures, your moon pictures, just post them and tag us through the hashtags. Through the hashtag. You see? Hashtag SM Super Hashtag SM Super Malls. Hashtag BSYA. And hashtag The Great Conjunction. So, with that, we may end this stream with leaving the simulation up for a couple of minutes. So, thank you all so much for joining us tonight. We really, really appreciate your participation in our event so much. We would like, we would like to thank our club moderator, Sergio Canigal, for live streaming his camera on his telescope to give us the possible best view that he has of the day. Uh, yeah, I want to shout out the officer. Yeah. So, ikaw is yung Miami last night just ka? Ayan, so pinapasabi ng ating moderator that we were able to see the conjunction even for a few minutes. I think that's already enough, but for your own benefit, if you still want to see a closer view of Jupiter and Saturn, I think you can see them in your own sky. I think that's a lot better than seeing it virtually. But thank you again for joining us. GC? Yeah. For our sure. outro, again, I am Ace Mendoza, ang alas ng masa, and... And I am Gigi Gaspar, and I'm G to see the world beyond with you. So for that, I'd like to say thank you. Thank everyone. you so much, guys. Stay safe and happy holidays. Yeah. Bye bye. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other thing, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone.